go back to bed. You're dressed. And it's so dark. Did you get an emergency call? Did the lion have babies yet? The lioness hasn't dropped yet. The jaguar and the cheetah both still waiting. The bird's still on their eggs. Are you leaving to get away from me? <laughs> Tell me. The truth. You hate me. You hate my looks. My face, my clothes. You hate me. You wish I was fatter so there'd be more of me to hate. <laughs>
Two years ago today. Two days ago today? Ah, today. <laughs> we used to have a beautiful old green Buick. The green latrine. I'm not allowed to drive it anymore, but when I could drive it, the last time I drove it, I drove into Manhattan and I drive down Broadway, the crossroads of the world. I see a scene you wouldn't see in your wildest dreams. 42nd Street, Broadway, four corners, four people, one on each corner, all waving for taxis, Cardinal Spellman, Jackie Kennedy, Bob Hope, and President Johnson, all carrying suitcases, taxi, taxi. I stop in the middle of the street, middle of Broadway, and I get out. Yes. I get out of my green latrine and yell, get it, I'm a gypsy. A gypsy cab. Get in. I'll take you where you want to go. Don't you all know each other? Get in. Get in. And they keep waiting for cabs. So I, I run over to President Johnson and grab him by the arm, get in, and pull Jackie Kennedy into my car. And John John, who I didn't see, starts crying. And Jackie hits me, and I hit her. And I, 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 I grab, I grab Bob Hope and push Cardinal Spellman into the back seat, crying and laughing. I'll take you where you want to go. Get in and give me your suitcases. And the suitcases spill open. And Jackie Kennedy's wigs blow down to the second <laughs> And Cardinal Spellman hits me, and Johnson screams, and I hit him. I hit them all. <laughs> and then the green latrine blew four flat tires and stink. And I run to protect the car, and four cabs appear. And all my friends run into four different cabs. <laughs> and cars are honking at me to move. So I push the car over the bridge, back to Queens. You're asleep. And I, I turned on Johnny Carson to get my mind off. <laughs> and there's Cardinal Spellman and Bob Hope, whose nose is still bleeding. And they tell the story of what happened to them. And everybody laughs. 30 million people watch Johnny Carson, and they all laugh at me. At me. I'm nobody. I knew all those people better than me. You, Ronnie. I know everything about them. Why can't they love me? And then it, it began to snow, and I went up on the roof. See the Pope. Pray. Miracles happen. He'll bless you. Reader's Digest has an article this month on how prayer answers things. Pray. Kneel down in the streets. The Pope can cure you. Reader's Digest don't afford to crap around. My fingernails are all different lengths. <laughs> Everybody's laugh. I think. <laughs> you just have fun. <laughs> Sometimes I miss you so much. I don't blame you for that lady, Artie. I really don't. But I'm going to be good to you now. Cooking. I didn't know you liked cooking. All these years, and I didn't know you liked cooking. See? You can live with a person and... Oh, God, Artie. If my 
Mark were finally alone for the first time in our life. Like it's taken us 18 years to get from the church to the hotel room. And we're finally alone. I promise you I'm going to be different. I promise you.